Hey there, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so today is the YouTubers Weekly Stamping Collaboration. Hosting this week is Patty from Patty's Polish Corner. And the theme is red or pink nail art nails. So I think that's I think that's it. <laughs> okay, so on my nails, this gorgeous red is from Dimension Nails and it's called Scarlet Peacock Butterfly. And this color is just stunning. So I meant to file my nails down for work tomorrow, but yeah, I totally forgot. And then I started painting and then I'm like, nah, it's staying. <laughs> okay, so we are going to um, I'm going to use BM317. I'm going to use these hearts. And since I'm on a kick of using my She Modern Sticky Stamping Polish, I'm going to use white today because I want it to kind of pop. I'm going to use this hot pink and this gold. I figured on the red it would look cool. Um, I don't know an item number. I've had this for eons, like years and years, so I don't know if it's available from Born Pretty. It's obviously Born Pretty. Um, so, but look, hot pink pigment powder. And then this gold chrome. I got this from EC Cosmetics. I want to give away and... Um, they sent me this as well. It's, I got a ton of it. I spilt acetone on the lid. I've got so much pigment powders and stuff, so I'm trying to, um, I'm trying to use them all. <laughs> and the sticky stamping polish is just perfect. So it gives me a chance to play with some of my pigment powders. Okay, I think... I'm set. Oh, and I got two little brushes. So, uh, yeah, well, I'm going to use this one. Do, do, do. I think I'm set. I think I said that already, but I'm like, ah, what am I doing? So, I don't know if this image will totally fit on any of my nails, but, um, We'll just add some if needed. Okay, so I did pretty good there. So I'm just gonna clean off my stamper. And this, move it over. So I'm just gonna take some pigment powder and kind of go in different areas. And then we're going to take some of this gold. I'm just taking it off the lid because, you know, it, um, use it all. I'm going to use it all. Put some more pink on because I want to make sure. It'll look good. A little more pink on this side. Make sure it stays. And I used the white this time just so. Um, it would pop a little more. It's kind of cool. So what I might do is just do them all pink and then just do that big heart in gold. Let's, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Which one's which? Okay, that's pink. I'm trying to make sure I keep the brushes together. Okay, so that's one. Let's do some more. Okay. 
so you can totally put I had um, I, someone ask about whether you could put the um, the um, powder directly on the stamper and yes you can um, when you can't quite see what is happening um, like for placement um, but you can totally do it I like doing this way because then I get to play more I'm just kind of adding a couple little hearts on the bottom I don't know if you got that so yeah, you can you can totally add it on the stamper. What I'll try and do is my next mani that I do, I'll try and do some more um, pigment stamping and then I'll do that. So let's do the big heart in gold again. And we'll do the rest. Pink. That'll look cute since I kind of did that one. This pink is very vibrant because originally I was just going to do gold, but then I looked and I'm like, okay, well, the prompt is pink and red. And I'm thinking, well, oh, but I still wanted to use the gold. <laughs> so. And I'm just leaving it on right now. I'm going to wipe it off at the end. That way it kind of stays in there. So. In case you were wondering. So hold down the plate. Scrape. And pick up. We'll do. There. So I don't go right away um, and in with the powders. I kind of let it sit for a minute to kind of dry just a little bit. I don't know if I need to or not, um, but I do just, just to be on the safe side. Do, do, do. And now. Pink. So I'll just go all the way around. We got powder everywhere. It is a little messy with the powder, but um, it's fun. I enjoy this. So. Oh. Two, two more. So I hope everybody is doing well. It's uh, been raining here all day. So I did my Walmart. Um, this is Sunday. I always film ahead for these. For the YouTubers Weekly Stamping Collaborations, we always film ahead. In case you were curious. Um because then we give everybody um, a copy of our video and then um, so then everybody has has it so they can put it in their video and then we give everybody links when we've done our video and then they can put those in so um, yeah so I, I film ahead on well, on the YouTubers one, I do. Other videos, not unless it's for like a birthday club. I usually film that day. I either post that day or the next day, depending on um, how late it is. Because <laughs> if I film during the week, I'm doing it after work because I work full time. And uh, so I do it after work. And then by the time I'm finished, it's it's late you know it could be nine o'clock and I go to bed at 10 because I start work early 
So I'm going to get rid of this BM just in case. I don't want it See, it didn't fit my thumb. So we're going to add so you can, if it doesn't fit your thumb, you can always add to it. So I've got open top ones there, or bottom. So I'm going to go and add some there. didn't fit the sides so there added some there and add a little bit there they're a little wonky looking but uh, for the most part it is my thumb so I don't worry as much but if you're looking that close at my nail, you know, oops. So, anyway, so putting some gold. So, yeah, it's been raining all day. I did get up early this morning. I always go to Walmart on Sunday morning, either Saturday or Sunday morning, but, um, oh, sorry, I'm not in frame here, sorry. Um, just so I can get my shopping out of the way and um, done before people get in there. Because, you know, they say that COVID's, here anyway they they say oh yeah it's it's under control but you know you see the amount of people in the hospitals i mean they try and say it's mostly people that are not vaccinated which i'm sure a majority aren't but they're saying it, it's higher than it was before and um also, but there's so many people dying and it's like, why, why is there more people dying and more people in the hospital if it's under control? <laughs> like, and that doesn't make sense. I mean, if you, if you don't want to get vaccinated, you do you. I'm not against anybody, you know, it's your choice, your body, that kind of thing. I personally, I went and got vaccinated because I wanted to be safe. And I hate being sick. <laughs> so that was my choice. Right? But, I mean, I'm not going to complain to someone. But um, I'm still going to make sure I'm safe. So I go shopping early. Oh, look at that. Look at that. I'm so happy. So I like how that turned out. That is so pretty. Look at the thumb. So, and then with my brushes, what I do is um, I rinse them under hot water and then with a little bit of um, dish soap, and then I just let them dry. Um, and they get all the pigment out. I mean, you can, you can also do that, but I want to make sure I get all the pigment out, so I, I make sure I wash them. So, just so in case you were curious. So, okay, so now around my edges, I'm going to grab my tape and then I'm going to clean up. And then I will also, once I'm done this part, I will get um, some, a little brush dipped in acetone and then clean up. So let me finish cleaning up. Let's see, I got pigment everywhere too. So let me clean up and then we'll come back and we will top coat. Okay, one moment. Okay, so I've kind of cleaned up. I'll still clean up probably um, a little bit like on my hands or whatever. But 
um, and then I'll have to put some cuticle oil on once I'm done. But uh, now I'm adding some foil stamping sealer. Um, you can use any water-based top coat. Just because I'm using the She Modern Sticky Stamping Polishes, I'm going to do the same. And I just do a thin, super thin, quick coat. Just kind of sealing in the powders. It dries really quick, so as long as you put a thin coat on. And then once this is done, once it's dry, there we go. Oh, I love it. Uh, once this is dry, then I will go in with my usual SC Speed Setter top coat. So, there you have it. I absolutely love how it turned out. I'm so pleased with it. I'm glad I did the big heart in the gold and the rest in the pink. So, I think it's cute. So, anyway, what do you think? Do you like it? Um, yeah, so I will have um, our collage photo and then individual photos of the ladies who participated this week. And then I will also have some puppies at the end. So thanks for hanging out with me while I do my nails for the YouTubers Weekly Stamping Collaboration. I hope you enjoyed it, and um, thanks for hanging out with me. Okay, I love you guys, and remember, be someone sparkle. Bye! Look how these age before your eyes.